Welcome to another Sentry Show and Tell. Edward is a Sentry engineer who works on our Discover and Dashboards team. Edward's going to tell us about a new feature his team made to query for custom performance metrics. And don't worry, he'll also explain what custom performance metrics are. Custom performance metrics are available for our JavaScript and Python SDKs. Check out our documentation linked in the description. Hey everyone, this is Edward from the Discover and Dashboards team. Today I've got a demo on custom performance metrics in Discover and Dashboards. In case you haven't heard of custom performance metrics, they're basically just user-defined measurements attached to a Sentry transaction, just like FCP or LCP, but with the major difference being that they're defined by the user rather than Sentry. There's also a bunch of great documentation in the Sentry docs site to check out if you need more details. So what the DND team has done is enable these custom performance metrics to be queryable in Discover and Dashboard pages. Here's an example on how you can query for a custom performance metric in your dashboard widget. In the widget builder, I'm going to select transaction and P99 of my custom performance metric, which I've already created beforehand. You can see what it looks like in the preview. I'm going to click save, and we now have a custom performance metric in our dashboard. So in Discover, you can also query for custom performance metrics. I'll open up the column editor, delete all the columns I'm not interested in, and add the P99 of my custom performance metric. And I'll also change the y-axis. You can drill down on a transaction name to see the value of each individual event. You can also apply a filter based on your custom performance metric like so. And you can open up an individual event to see all custom performance metrics associated. That's all for this demo. Thanks for watching.